After a long mid-season break, these two teams return to Premier League action in opposition here at Villa Park this evening. Leeds United came to this ground and won by three goals to nil last season. Patrick Bamford scoring a hat-trick, but he's one of a number of star players still unavailable for the away side. Villa have changed their manager already this season. Steven Gerrard in charge now. Early signs are that he might be able to turn around their fortunes with a climb higher up the table. Rodrigo's won it anyway. A little bit of a scramble on the edge of the box. Dan James! Oh, what a finish from James! <laughs> Drives it low and hard into the far corner of the net. Snapshot and Leeds United get the opening goal here at Villa Park. Villa nil, Leeds one. Jack Harrison's going down the left-hand side, play the ball in field to Dan James on the edge of the penalty area. Oh, oh he's hit the crossbar. Well, what a goal that would have been for Dan James. The ball is played into the edge of the penalty area. Coutinho! Oh, they gave him space and he took full advantage and he puts his shot beyond the dive of Melier and Aston Villa are all square, 1-1. One, one. Lovely turn from Coutinho oh. away from oh. Aylan. He's played a fantastic ball to Ramsey, who's through here. Ramsey scores for Villa. Well, it was that simple. The ball played into the path of Ramsey, and he was beyond the last defender. And Villa have turned this one round. Coutinho plays the ball out towards the far side in the penalty area, and the shot is into the back of the net. And again, that combination with Coutinho into Ramsey and the ball is rifled up into the top corner Klee who's found a bit of space forced away from goal to the edge of the box little back heel he's got it into Rodrigo cuts it back into the middle Dan James underneath it he scored Dan James with a header from close range has got Leeds back in the game right before the end of added time goes short to Rodrigo Rodrigo Plays the ball in from the byline, it flicks up in the air, heads underneath it, and stroke again, and it's in! And it's Llorente, who's equalised for Leeds United, stabs the ball in from close range, and as you might imagine, there are now crazy scenes <laughs> on the far side of the stadium, because it's Aston Villa 3, Leeds United 3. Matty Cash into the penalty area, heads go up in the box, breaks clear, and Luke Ayling is underneath it to try and clear it. Still alive for Villa, though, flicks up in the air, and it's booted into touch, and that is the best. And the final action in a pulsating Premier League fixture here. It swung this way, and that goals galore, and ultimately, perhaps, these Leeds United players who put in a fantastic shift will count themselves just a little disappointed in the fact that they're not walking off with a victory here at Villa Park. Leeds took the lead early on, Villa raced back into it, went 3-1 ahead. Dan James clawed a goal back right on half-time. Llorente made it 3-3 in the second half. After that, it was Leeds piling forward, but just couldn't find the crucial moment. Nevertheless, this is a really good point for Leeds. Full-time scoreline here, Aston Villa 3, Leeds United 3.